ghost wood. <coughs> I need a drink. Did that whiskey show up yet? Sure did. And I think you'll be glad to hear that I saved whiskey requisition form you already filled out. You want a shot or a whole bottle? I want the whole damned bottle. A thousand meat? What? How much meat do I have? 3,000? That's not even enough to get to the damn carnival. Hell yeah, girl. That better be the best fucking whiskey known to man. Oh, you know what I forgot to eat was a ghost pickle. We're gonna get wrecked by melee abilities now. Trish navigates a bunch of weird rock formations. Everything suddenly goes silent. Everything except for the racing of your pulse. That is because you stumbled upon a horrifying ungulate. We got the jump on you now, cow. Woo, 61. <coughs> Yes! I tried to barter with the clown. He's a piece of shit. Here's your filthy permit, you filthy fuck. Achievement unlocked our daily bread. I just hope to never see another thing, huh? The camp only has one problem. What problem is that? Bad lumber deal. We're giving lumber to the railroad company for, like, no meat at all, and that's bad. There's no... Okay. Okay. Do, do, do. Ah, yes. I still haven't found a good mushroom place. Do I even need this? I got something to sell. I'm not going to use this like ever. Two of those, I don't really know if I need them. Infernal leather. Guess I'll keep that for now. You have binoculars actually? Lasso, a length of rope. Do I have any rope? I think I might be out of rope. Nope, I have some still. Four of them. Good. Am I gonna read the next max? I don't know. It keeps fucking me up. And withering my body away. People are gonna think I'm the damn necromancer. Even though I can summon skeletons. Okay, so... Let's see... Jelly beans. What else do we got, though? Dutch oven. Alright. Let's go to the Dutch oven. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Doo, doo. I need stench resistance. The sluice isn't very tight. Tighten it. Oh. Great. Oh, there's a sluice here. I see it. Okay, stench resistance it is. Where's my gas mask? What up? Ba -dum -bum 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 -bum. Okay, didn't even see that before. I just crawl into the elevator. That's so great. Uh, 
<coughs> Try to talk to him. Nope. Nothing. Oh, shit. <coughs> now we can actually open this. This pile was pretty obviously made on purpose. Closer inspection reveals that stones are mortared together. What could be hidden in here? All right, boys. Talk the rocks into leaving. Magic the rocks away. Move the rocks by hand or bust up the pile. And I'm a beast, so I can do whatever here. I'm gonna talk them into leaving. You are one smooth talker. Yes, I am. Not even a problem. Hello. You have learned the Elvrata <laughs> word for toilet. It says Central Quick Gate Facility. Something Central Quick Gate Facility. You got the Elvrata El loop. What does that do? Try it on. As you place the ring on your head, two things happen. One is that it begins humming and shimmering in that weird El Vibrato thing shimmer way. The other is that you feel suddenly as if you put earplugs in your brain. Your thoughts get weirdly quiet. Weird. I'll say it's weird and not entirely pleasant. You take off the headband. Okie dokie then. Machine is dark. There's a circle hole in the bottom. Maybe I need a key for that. I need safe cracking still. Three buttons on top of it. Those things aren't friendly. Neither am I. Hup. I might put my dick in it. I just may. I'm too damn strong. Oh. Goodbye. Overkill, kill, kill. Yep. I am extremely powerful. Punch, punch. I'm a cow puncher. I punched the cows. I got a punch card from these. Yes. A complicated punch card. Hooray! Thought so. Let's do it. I just want to make sure I kill them. Every hit. They shoot like little bullets or what? They can't hit shit. Hup, 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 hup. This is the West of Loathing, Tyrion. Cowboys and aliens, apparently. Yarg! I got punch cards like a boss. Doorway, no keys or handles or anything. Okay. So we need a key. There's also a place to farm vibrato there. We got a few punch cards. We can go punch back into the well. I don't know why I just don't take this thing. Abandoned well. Where is... Ah, there it is. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. You got a rancher's pistol. What? What? Oh, I couldn't control myself for a second there. It's lifeless. I'm gonna go learn more words. Extraterrestrial Personnel Municipal. East Cannon Garbage. Local Weather. It's 
storage online. Chrono key insufficient emergency. I am learning all sorts of their language, bro. Yeah, I just don't spoil. Alright, Susie, what now? I did that. Hmm. Oh, one, two, three. I really want to go into the circus. What up, bruh? Why is it so expensive? You are doing a very good job. Never mind. See, he doesn't want a fucking thing to do with me. Not a fucking thing. That clown gives no shits. My gas mask makes me feel like a BDSM master. Gimp daddy. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Oh my goodness, where am I? I'm still in the mine, uninjured and hungry, but not starving. So I can't have been here very long, perhaps a day. Good, good. Well, I must have you to thank my friend. Okay. Murray Murray Morris, excavator of the unknown and purveyor of mysteries. What brings you to this mine? Why, excavating the unknown for mysteries to purvey, of course, or at least attempting to. I must admit that until you put this device on me, I was quite overcome. Quite. I am oversensitive to psychic emanations. You see, I always have been. As it happens, this curious little hole is absolutely overflowing with them. And they're none too friendly. I can tell you that for certain. It was risky business, my coming down here, but I took the gamble and lost. It's a miraculous thing that you happened by when you did, my friend. We should both get out of here as soon as possible. I've been staying in a town called Dirtwater. A capital idea, and I shall see you there. Later, Murray. Skirt, skirt, skirt. Let's go see what that guy's all about. In a moment. Achoo. <laughs> ah. Oh, you should have one shot him, you scumbag. The gas mask is my best friend. With a shout, well, more of a loud hiss, a skeleton leaps out from the underbrush. He's wearing a cavalry hat. Give him the old drill sergeant drilling. A tin hut! Just what do you think you're doing out of uniform, soldier? Look at this pathetic display. Buttons missing, sleeves torn. Total lack of skin. And where's your horse? You're a disgrace, disgrace to your unit. I'm putting you on latrine duty for a month. About face march! Later, bitch. Scarecrow? I'll fix the Scarecrow up. Oh. Okay. Thought I was gonna have to fight it or something creepy. El Vibrato! I like the speed how it is. I'm not finding shit. You see a streak of fire blast across the sky and land just over the horizon. You ride to the side of the impact and find a meteor. Get after it with your pickaxe. Oh, daddy! The meat Tior. My pickaxe melted. 
I hope I have more than one of those. I got Stardust. Sweet. I'm just wandering, baby. Don't mind me. Decent wine, decent tequila, and decent whiskey. Nice. I need more ashes and a glass ball. Yep. This is true. I probably have enough meat to buy a ticket. Up, 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 up. Man, I can't find shit. A loud flock noise draws your attention and you follow the sound of a man in a once white apron who is butchering a bighorn sheep or some kind of other large desert animal with an oversized and heavy looking meat cleaver. As he's hauling the implement up onto his shoulder for another blow, he catches sight of you and hisses with a wild look in his eye. Who's there? Don't test me, boy. I'll chop you up like this goat or whatever it is. Yikes. Show him how it's done. We grab the cleaver's hand from the non-plussed butcher, lift the blade over your head and with a yarn, and slam it in the carcass, chopping the beast right in half. What do you think of that? I'll just collect my meat and go. Go ahead and keep the chopper. That's fine. Okay. Oh my fucking god! One hundred dollars and sixty-nine cents from uh Celerino. Holy shit, dude! Thank you so much, Celerino. That is unfucking believable. Damn, girl. Whoo. Man, that is crazy. Thank you so much. Is this game lit? You fucking know it's lit. You know it's lit. Hmm. Oh, that sucks. <sighs> the west side of the map over here, maybe? Yeah, there's a lot of stuff over here. Not translate those 35 mysticality. Let's do some wandering. Holy shit, dude. It's dead. It's fast, though. 2 HP. What are you talking about, Tyrion? I just was talking to you earlier today when you came in here. Okay. What's up, Fat Halbert? I'm pretty sure I say thank you to every single person that subs, tips, or drops bits, period. Jesus. Meet a strange silvery crystal. Maybe I can get the jeweler to do something with that. The workings are too rusty to work. Align it. Ride it down. That's right, pie filling. Shut your pie hole. All I usually say in chat is, what up? <laughs> oh. 
orthopedic boots. 20 to max HP. And these boots are the finest foot care devices the medical technology of the 1890s has to offer. Which is to say they've got sheepskin insoles and they're coated with gauze to help soak up ankle blood. Wasn't that helpful? Oh god, look at this. I don't have a pickaxe. Wow. Broke ass shit. What up, the Rin? What up? I really need a pickaxe. I like this little hole. You hate this spiral. You don't like this. Deepest Delve. I gotta go get a damn pickaxe because I melted mine smacking a meteor. BRB. There's gotta be a minecart somewhere to be able to push. Okay. Dude, they are fast and they hurt. Oh god, I'm gonna die, maybe. What? None of them attack little Susie. A hundred and eighty-five health. Well, what? I did not know I could do that. Lasso it. Punch! I can't lasso again this turn. GG. Only 24 damage. Wow, dude. I'm still alive? I guess I could have stunned the other one. them. Yes. Oh, yeah, that's helpful. Ooh. Sniff it. Sniff the shit out of it, dude. Shit, sniff it, dude. Dun, dun, 
Dun, dun, dun, dun, dun, dun, dun. Didn't even know I had that. Those are terrible, truly. Sniffy sniff sniff. We're not going down today, partner. You know, a better hat would probably help. Put it on your hat to add three moxie. Well, that seems fucking nice. to push or anything. Gotta go get a pickaxe. I do have 5k. Is it even worth it to buy a circus ticket? I don't know. The girl who baked six months in a row. Like I'm gonna have to spend money once I get inside the circus, I would imagine. Okay, which town has the trading post? I think it's Breadwood. It's hard to remember where all these little places are. I also could go use my leather working. We haven't checked back in our town for our purveyor either. Isn't there like a trading post somewhere? The meat is basically your... Um your money. Well, they don't have what we want here. Let's go see if the jeweler wants this strange silvery crystal. Fort unnecessary. Let's go. Oh, it's right here. The turnip is gone because I gave it to the fucking asshole. I don't worry about it. A harried looking young woman in a military outfit darts in front of you, the door as you enter. Oh no, I can't be having any more misfits in this jerk ward. You can either swear to me that you're halfway competent, heck, even a quarter, and that you'll help sort out this crew of no-hopers, or you can turn right back around and march double time. Sure, I'll help. All right, I'm gonna hold you to that promise. Come on in, I'm Captain Harriet Davenport. My name is Bear Wales. What's the problem, Cap? Problems. Welcome to Camp Foobar, where all the army's idiots and rejects are sent so they're out of the way. I have had my, up to my eyeballs trying to run this place. Please help these morons figure out their malfunctions so they can muster out of here and leave me in peace. Holy text daddy. Jesus. Okay, can you give me some details? You'll need to talk to them individually for more information, but the brief is, we've got a scout who's blind as a bat, a cook who can't figure out how to make corned beef hash on toast, a guy who can't load a fire and fire a cannon without it blowing up or maybe shooting backwards, a guy who somehow, and I can't for the life of me figure it out, is too bow-legged to ride a horse, and a kid who was, was sitting here because he can't figure out how to tie a bow tie. Oh, and just to put the icing on the cake, we have infinite goblins living in our storage shed. Wow. Okie dokie. What did you do to get us in here? Okay, then. The whole place is an Easter egg by the devs. New glasses. Try to get you a new pair of glasses. There's a jeweler, grind me a pair of glasses, make them thick as dickens. Okay. Medal of Adequacy, wow, that's nice. Yeah, boys, upgrade. All oh, gee willikers, I had a pretty good job of the general's personal assistant, but I got fired and reassigned here. What happened? 
Everything was great at first. I'm pretty good at scheduling and I can write shorthand. And I'm a plus boot polisher. But then the general one decided he looked more serious and sophisticated with the bow tie. He expected me to do the tying for him. 45 moxie. Okay. I am 12 moxie off of that shit. Huh. Maybe I have some items I can put on, though, real quick. That'd give me the moxie. Do, 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 do. Nope. This gives me seven moxie. That's going to be pretty high. Rancher's pistol, five moxie. Okay. Six Moxie for the Sweet Sword. Souvenir Spoon's already given me the Moxie, I think. It is a nice metal. That's better. That should do it, I think. I don't know how the Nasty Ring gives me a Moxie, but that's fine. And 44? I'm one moxie off? No fucking way, dude. Try to help him out with a metaphor. What if you thought of the toast as a road map? He nods, seeming to understand where you're going with this. And think of the corn beef hash as. <laughs> a hole in the ground. So I should put the corned beef hash under. No, next to. No, 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 sorry, I don't get it. Can we try again? Let's try again. A road map. Shinola. I like the road map. No, no. A shingle. I don't think... Your elbow and your head. Shingle and a shinola. I don't, I don't know if any of these are actually the right answer. Two tie, 14 months in a row. You got your first tattoo yesterday, and while I was watching, waiting, I watched your stream. Cheers to 14 months, bro. Well, awesome. Well, thank you very much for watching. Uh, a shoe and your head. Nope. Shoe on head. <laughs> it didn't work, damn it. I try the roadmap with every combination. I don't think any of these work. I can try every one with everything, though. A shingle on your head. Nope. I tried all of these. I don't think any of these work. I don't know what the hell a Shinola is. I'm not gonna be helping that guy anytime soon. They're so fucking sad. Hi, what's wrong? Oh, gee willikers, I had a pretty- wait, this is the same fucking place. I need one moxie. Get off me. Get off me! hate you. Let me walk past you, dick face. I swear to God it won't let me walk past this person. There we go. This horse has four legs. How do they call me Private Bow Legs? I can see why. You seem uncomfortable. You ain't kidding. Look at my legs. They're bent so far out I can hardly touch both knees at once. Walking herds like dickens. 
horse slips right out between them. I think I could ride a mule, though. What with him being a tad lower to the ground? I'll just bend his legs back. You don't need a mule. This is fixable. Hold on a minute while I... Okay. With some grunts from you and some cries of pain from him, you normalize his legs. Oh, wow. Great jump at Jiminy, man. Oh, don't be a baby. Look, they're much straighter now. I guess I can't deny that. Woo! Hey, thank you for the biddies red shirt, zombie. A shoe and the hole in the ground. A shingle goes on to a roof, a.k.a. a head. <laughs> I mean, I like your logic, guys. Cannoneer. Um, I have cannon loading for idiots. Let him figure it out. Got him! My sign-in says, important gun storage, no goblins. Okay, I'm gonna yank a few out. He's got the, <laughs> the gun backwards. Look at this little guy. That's cute. Goodbye, goblin. Goblin short pants. Great. A shingle and a hole in the ground. A shingle and a corn cob pipe. A shingle and a shinola. A shingle and your head. A shingle and a hole in the ground. A shoe and a corn cob pipe. A shoe and a shinola. Oh! Fantastic! What up, girl? Okay, here, grab the two little ends like this, right? You want this side a little shorter and that end crosses over top and then up under. Well, the other side does a sort of zigzag, see? Then you bring the upper bit straight down and back around and fold it under there and then you pull them tight, got it? The two of you go back and forth a few times until he finally gets it right without poking himself in the eye. Booyah, what up? This guy needs glasses. I think we fixed everybody else just about. That wasn't that bad. Let's get out of our stupid moxie gear. Boom, boom, bam, bam, bam. 13 to 17. Okay. use the mushroom covered bone we're gonna use actually I mean the other one's probably better okay so let's go to the jeweler and try to get some glasses made for this fuckboy. boy. 